Oh, look at this. This is a good one. Some suggest that Parker's powers include the male spider's ability to hypnotize females. Stop. Come on. <laughs> yes, my spider lord. All right, so. Start us off. <laughs> what's been the best thing about Spider-Man and what's been the worst thing about being Spider-Man? I think one of the best things about Spider-Man was me and you guys. Aww. You know? Um, and I can't really think of the worst thing. I think the worst thing about playing Spider-Man is the lack of toilet breaks I get. Mm. Because <laughs> the suit is so tight right. and we all know how long it takes me to take it on and off right. that I don't get to go to the toilet all that often. So that's probably the worst thing. But the best thing is me and you guys. Aww. And we're here in London, and London's not ready. We're going out for dinner tonight, and London better buckle up. <laughs> but, uh, I'm next. Both the Spider-Man movies and Euphoria are in high school settings. Mm -hmm. What advice do you think Rue and MJ would give each other? I don't know if Rue should be giving any advice right now. <laughs> I think maybe she should just chill, you know? Yeah, I think she um, could use some advice. Maybe, maybe ask her in a few years, mm, you know? Advice. She'll have great advice then. <laughs> <laughs> but um, I would say, I don't know. I don't know if they would give each other advice so much. It's just, I, I think they'd actually really get along. I think they would really And I think they along. would be good for each other. I think MJ would be excellent for Rue. Yeah. Yeah, okay. I think they'd be great friends. Okay, Ned has done such a great job oh. keeping Peter's secret. Hmm. And you have done a great job keeping <clears throat> Spider-Man No Way Home a secret. So are you naturally talented at secret keeping? Uh, you know, honestly, I think that I don't want to lose my job. So I think nice. if anything, I'm nice. good at like not wanting to ruin my career. But uh, fair enough. <laughs> but who's no, the yeah. best at keeping secrets on set? This is a multi oh. question. Question. I think uh, I think everyone's pretty good, um, and, and I think it's mostly because no one really knows what happens. So <laughs> yeah, if you don't think, know, you yeah, can't. Yeah, know. you can't say anything. So it's pretty. Everything's pretty secret. And so. who's the worst? Is that even a question? Yeah. Is it me? You've been doing so well, though. Yeah, you've I've this this whole time for this one has been really. Good. I've really tried yeah. my best on this. For one. sure. calls here and there, but yeah, overall, but really good. That's why they've paired me well with done. you two. <laughs> we don't trust him alone. Yeah, it's tough. <laughs> oh no, it's your turn. It's your All right. Turn. If you could meet another version of yourself that exists in the multiverse, who would that be, and what would you hope they would be like? Hmm. If I could meet myself, I would like to meet the version of myself that has just won the Ballon d'Or. Thomas Tolley. And is the greatest football player to have ever lived. <laughs> that is the version of myself I would like to meet. And I would then like to kill him. <laughs> and and take become all him. of his power. <laughs> and become And him. absorb him. <laughs> <laughs> and absorb him. <laughs> yeah, that's who, that's who I would like to meet. Who would you like to meet? Oh, well, it's just a question for you. No, no it's just Tom and Tom and Really? Yeah. yeah. Oh. I didn't know that. I Who would you like to meet? What version of yourself? Um, I don't know. Um, I would like to meet a version of myself that um, maybe became a teacher like my parents. Yeah. Oh, very yeah. nice. I think it would be really funny to meet the version of Zendaya that like drinks and smokes. And like, <laughs> a, like a bleep right off. Yeah, party. right. <laughs> Party animal? <laughs> party animal. I don't know. Maybe there. maybe they're out there. Mm, <laughs> definitely yeah. out there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'd be so worried. Like, what have you done to Zendaya? <laughs> <laughs> this isn't uh, you. Okay, which other MCU hero or villain could really use Ned Leeds as a best friend? Whew. Whew. I, I think that everyone kind of needs a Ned Leeds. Mm. And not to just want to be in everyone's movies, but I think that... <laughs> Yeah, I think that everyone sort of needs a, a best friend, chair. a guy in the chair for sure. Uh, I can't really say one specifically because I feel like they're all pretty much not damaged, but like they're all pretty much like in hard places. What um, um what like non MCU movie do you think Ned Leeds would fit in the best? <laughs> uh, I'd love to see Ned Leeds in like a Saw movie. <laughs> a Saw? <laughs> yeah, that'd be that'd be really funny. Yeah, any anything crazy horror or crazy <laughs> dramatic. Be so funny in a horror movie. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, so any any of the any of the heroes who who would love to have him around for sure. Nice. <laughs> Name your top three Spider-Man villains you've had mm -hmm. to square off against, and mm -hmm. who do you want to see him take on next? Oh, that's tricky. Mm -hmm. I think the Vulture's got to be in there because he's my first. Yeah, that mm -hmm. one. That one's cool. I think Jake's got to be in there because it's he's Jake. my love. <laughs> he's Jake, <laughs> and I think Willem. The fight scenes that we have with Willem in this For film sure. are Terrifying. so crazy and For so sure. scary that it really was 
awesome to like mm. explore different kind of Spider-Man action. Mm. Who do you want to see him take on next? Oh, next film. Do you know what? I actually think the Morbius film looks really cool. Mm. And it's quite mm. scary, that film. Yeah. yeah, it does look scary. I think Morbius could be quite a cool thing to yeah. do. To mix that up. Spider-Man versus a vampire. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Like that. All right. Yeah, like that. that. <laughs> Whoa. Uh, oh. What was the most heartwarming scene in all of the franchise for you? The most heartwarming scene. I know. Mm. We all know. Oh, oh yeah, for sure. Are you really thinking about this? Well, no, I'm trying hurtful. to think. I'm trying to think know, of a scene dude. that I can talk about. <laughs> you know, I can't. There's a scene in this film that is amazing between the three of us, which we can't talk about because it's a spoiler. But I think you in Avengers Endgame when we see oh, you yeah, in that hallway, that's true. that is really sweet. It's a yeah, really special true. moment. For it sure. like really grounds that film. I think it's a moment where people really. Sometimes with these big action films, you forget that they're supposed to exist in a realistic universe. Just so kids. seeing you at school and that it's affected kids yeah. really makes that film feel very grounded. I would agree. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Oh, it's my turn. What was the funniest Spider-Man scene to shoot? I, I can't say. Yeah, <laughs> the can't. funniest day. Um, you can't say that was I crazy. Can't, I can't say. And um, it was some funny. of my best work, personally. <laughs> off, off camera, unfortunately. I was on a roll. I was making everybody laugh that day. For sure. the poor sound man that yeah. kept coming in. I will and say I really, that. And I, yeah. and I added yeah. that into yeah. my number. That into no. a joke. Yeah, well done. Great. Zendaya's low-key funny as hell. Yeah. Well, that's, yeah. yeah. People didn't see it coming. What can I say? <laughs> All right. Is it my turn? It is yeah. your turn. Okay. What is one of your most favorite Spider-Man scenes in any other film or TV show? Hmm. Hmm. In any of the previous films. Hmm. Yeah. Put my ring on. My favorite Spider-Man moment. I feel bad like choosing one of my own. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they said other. Oh, they said yeah, other. Yeah. <laughs> so not yours. So it can't be yours. Yeah. <laughs> I like how your brain was just like, well, mine. Yeah, yeah obviously. obviously. Well, those moments that mean yeah, a lot that, to that, me. That's <laughs> uh, I really like Toby's fight scene with Doc Ock on the side of the building. Mm -hmm. I think that's really cool. There's a great moment where Doc Ock throws the the hands of the clock down and mm -hmm. he like webs it and then like flings it back at him. I think right. that's really cool. Yeah. What memory will you take away from the three of us working together? Um, I'm trying to think. Yeah, it's, there's a lot. All of it. Yeah, like, for I don't sure. Know what I'm trying there's to think. So much. I will say though, like now this movie has some great memories, but I will say the first movie. Yeah. Sticks mm. with me the most. Right. Remember we went on a picnic? Yeah, we all yeah. went on a picnic. We had like a whole adventure, like a whole like class adventure. Together. Yeah, or remember the, the decathlon thing? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, how funny. Like, I also yeah. like how like so... we used to say to each other, like, come over on the weekend and we could all play in my pool. And we did. Yeah, we, we literally we did, did all the time. Play in the pool. We did oh, movie man. nights. All the time. <laughs> movie nights was a big we, one. Yeah. It, we, it, we had a lot of fun. For sure. The cinema club was a big one. I think the party that we had at my house on the last day of shooting was a big one. Yeah. <laughs> I have a great video of me and you dancing. I oh, no, have you have the video yes. of me and you yes. dancing a sexual. <laughs> yeah, it's great. Classic. Yeah. Classic. Very sweet. Yeah. In love. Aww. Yeah. That's the last one I've got. What do you have? I have a couple more. Whoa. I have two more for Jacob. Oh, okay. <clears throat> what was the best action packed scene in our Spider Man trilogy? Oh, I can't speak on that, can I? Yeah, it's tough. Um, previous movies, maybe. Pre uh, previous movies. Yeah, previous movies. I think, um, I think in the second one, we all sort of like had to run away from explosions and stuff, and yeah. and like when I still you, have a dent in my yeah shin from thing, running dude. away from, from like Venice. yes from the Venice. Oh my! When you got your legs stuck in there, oh my goodness! <laughs> you really yeah. do actually. Yeah, it's still there. Get that checked out. Yeah. But, <laughs> yeah. Broken. So yeah, I guess anything from the second movie, and again, the third one is filled with so many things that we can't even speak on mm -hmm. that it'll probably trump all those other things. But yes. for sure, like yeah. all those other other. I also movies. think like, like, my one of my favorite scenes is like we were they were talking about the other day, but the um, you guys in the car finding out that the the vulture thing. Oh yeah, that is oh great. yeah, I oh, love that scene. Yeah. I know that no action is happening, but it's like so. It's like intense. Potential action. It's great. Yeah, it's intense for sure. Yeah, it's yeah. Great. and yeah. when like when Laura's like, "Oh, look at this picture," you're like, "Yeah, it's so cute." <laughs> Stress. <laughs> it cracks me up every time. Stress. So, how okay. was it like to work with Benedict Cumberbatch? 
It was pretty amazing. And, you know, I've worked with Ben quite a few times right. on the Avengers movies. I also did a film with him Other called Current War. Yeah, yeah Current War, yeah. Um, and he's awesome. Yeah, absolutely. Strange is a great character. Benedict is a great guy. Uh, he stole my beanbag, though. <laughs> this movie that you're working on also deals with electricity. Mm. <laughs> True. All the correlation. Yeah. Bitter subject. <laughs> um, but yeah, Benedict stole my beanbag. He actually, him and I are actually supposed to go, were supposed to go surfing a few weeks ago. Huh. Yeah, but I was not able to go. I have a great That's picture of him skateboarding around the yes, lot. Yes, you do, yeah. Which is cool because it's like Doctor Strange skateboarding. Skateboarding is <laughs> classic. Yeah, <that's> awesome. <laughs> if Ned got a spinoff, what do you think it would look like? Pitch, pitch us your show. Oh, yeah. A Ned spinoff. So a Ned Leeds spinoff would probably be uh, one where he works with, the Avengers. Shield? Shield? Yes. Shield. Yes. It's not oh, like, So, right. Sword. Like an official guy yeah. in the chair. So he would be That'd that. Be sick. And I feel like he'd probably work with every superhero. Um, not yeah, not just Spider-Man. And would leave me. I mean, I would I would give you all my time and also other people my time. Nice. And I <laughs> so feel you like give me all of your time if yeah. you're giving other people time. And I think that would be a great series on Disney Plus. That would be great. <laughs> so I think so a, Disney I think Plus, a, uh, like, a TV you... show with you and Fury would yeah. be really funny. I think that would be hilarious. Is like his new little uh, protege, yeah. Yeah, shadowing him. That would be hilarious. Yeah, like Mr. Fury have a notepad. Like, <laughs> why did you make that decision? <laughs> yeah, because the other one is a spoiler. Yeah. Oh, ha. Huh. Mm. Mm, interesting. His other possible plot. Ah. Mm. Uh-huh. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Things <Yeah>. to come. Oh. <laughs> Uh, yeah. Well, yeah. I, st I st that's it. The mid, this, the teachers of Midtown, though, for real. Teachers of Midtown. We need to have be that so be a good. show. <laughs> They're all hilarious. I want to see Martin and JB. Martin and yeah, JB and, and Hannah. They're lit. What a great show that would be. <laughs> Just like the mundane activities of yeah. like yeah. being a teacher at Midtown, and then like in the news, something happens with superheroes. <laughs> yeah. React to it. Uh, thanks, Van Dango. Yeah. Thank you, Van Dango.